Hey guys, welcome to another video here at Cloud Colubrids. So I hope everybody's doing all right. I know there's a lot of people in sticky situations with all this crazy weather. Um, out here in South Florida, it's been nice and warm. We had a couple of rainy days and today's my day off. Just enjoying the day and relaxing. Ah, too much milk in this coffee. So how many of you guys like ordering snakes or reptiles online? Me, I order a lot of stuff online if you watch my videos, my unboxings. And um, I got a lot of experience with ordering from these sites. So I just wanted to hit base and talk about the pros and cons of ordering on sites like Morph Market versus going and picking up an animal in person. It's going to be a good video, so stay tuned. Cons of... So once you order one or two snakes online, you're gonna find yourself checking Morph Market or Fauna Classifieds daily. You know, that's what I do. I'm always looking for that next snake to add to my collection and it's just so easy. You order, two days later, right at your doorstep. You just can't beat that. So the biggest plus about ordering snakes online is the ease of access. You don't have to leave your house. You could just go online, go on Morph Market, Fauna Classifieds, and type in whatever kind of a snake you're looking for. And they have such a wide variety, and it's hard to beat that. Even when you go in person, um, you're usually not gonna find the selection like you will online, because all breeders come to these sites to put their animals online. So you're gonna get a huge selection. And something that I always check for, make sure the picture of the animal or snake that you're buying is the exact animal because sometimes they'll put a picture re representing what you'll get, but not the actual animal. With frogs and stuff, that might not be an issue, but with snakes, you want the exact animal that you're paying for. So another pro is the excitement you feel after you ordered your snake and you gotta go pick it up at FedEx or UPS, or if it's coming to your house, you get the box, you open it up, you get that adrenaline rush. It's an excitement because you've never physically seen the snake. All you know is from the photo, so it's that excitement of opening up. It's almost like Christmas or something, opening up a present. So that's one of the pros that I always enjoy when I go to pick up my snake, open up the box, can't beat it. So before ordering from a breeder, make sure you know who he is. All you gotta do is go into his information and you could see his rating. See how many people rate him positive versus negative and they even leave comments. Now if you're gonna buy from like Morph Market or Fauna Classifieds, what I would do is join a bunch of Facebook groups for whatever you're interested in. If it's king snakes, hognose snakes, or frogs or reptiles and learn who's who usually people know who these breeders are you could even go right onto their page from the morph market information they'll leave you a link sometimes to their facebook you can just go into these groups and talk to the other breeders and they'll usually give you good information is this guy selling good quality stock how long has he been breeding and you could see all the pictures and stuff like that so fauna classifieds or um morph market they're just a platform like Facebook. All breeders could come on there and sell you their animals. It's not Morph Market that's actually selling you the animal. It's not their animals. They have nothing to do with the animals. They're just providing you the platform. And with that said, you're gonna get a bunch of breeders on there and most of them are good. But every once in a while you might meet somebody who's selling you a sick animal. When you go to a show, it's the same thing. You're gonna meet a bunch of breeders. Most of them are good people selling you really quality animals, but every so often you might bump into somebody who has sick animals, wild caught animals, or just trying to make a quick buck. So you can't really say it's better to buy in person or it's better to buy online. It's pretty much even um, playing field. The only advantage when you when you actually buy in person, you get to talk to the breeder and you actually get to see the animals first. So that would be the only pro about buying actually in person. So do I prefer ordering online or 
buying a snake in person at like a reptile show. It's tough because I love getting my package, my box when I order online. I get excited opening it up, but nothing beats going to a show, meeting all the people, getting to talk to the breeders, picking up all the little deli cups with the snakes or reptiles, and you get to see what you buy. I mean, you could really see what kind of animal you're getting, and you build relationships with the breeders. So overall, in person would be my preference, but if you can't get to a show, I highly recommend a site like Morph Market or Fauna Classifieds or even talk to a breeder on Facebook. Sometimes they'll sell you some snakes or reptiles if they're a quality breeder, but you have to direct message them because Facebook doesn't allow you to actually talk about buying animals or anything on their website. Now, one of the cons when you order online is the shipping cost. Um, sometimes the breeder will discount the snake because of the shipping cost, but most of the time, the online price is gonna be similar to a price where you would be able to buy the snake in person or at a reptile show. And shipping right now averages around 40 to $75, depending on the location. So that's something you gotta consider. So if you guys have any questions about buying snakes or reptiles online, anything that I didn't cover, or if you just wanted to ask something, leave comments below. I check my comments about every hour, so I'll definitely get back to you as soon as I can. And with that, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, gained some knowledge, be safe, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.